Hello there, and as usual, I'm Aaron from My Stand Gamers, and welcome. Now, you might be looking at this creation in front of me and recognize it already. Now, this is in fact a replica that I've been messing around of the particle cannon from CNC Generals. Now, if you got a chance to play CNC Generals, that was many, many moons ago, then you realize that the particle cannon is a very powerful weapon. Basically, it fires a laser up into space that is then redirected down onto a ground target and blows the hell out of things. Now, what would be really cool is if Space Engineers allowed you to reflect lasers, somebody made a modification so you could direct them from a satellite to another location, but that would just be a whole thing for another day. Anyway, let's talk about the construction of this and how I built things to replicate the actual particle cannon. Now, first off, we actually have the main hull of the device itself. This is where the laser is stored and protected inside the actual device itself. Very simple. We've actually got the housing out here with these little blue spotlights around the perimeter. This just gives it a little bit of a kind of a glow, a bit of a look to it, especially when the cannon raises up out of the night. Now, moving a little bit lower down and towards the actual tower itself, we have this rear section. Now, the rear section is a combination between two areas. In the game, they don't really explain which of the points do anything, but I'm guessing one is the control tower, so this is where all the things are organized. The satellites are actually found and calculated and then this second building is the radar sort of relay so this will probably go up send messages into space directing the satellite into position or satellites into position so you could direct the particle cannon anyway let's give this guy a little bit of a test run so i've got the reactor everything set up and let's activate a hood now first thing first we need to open the door so oh i've missed a little bit of the opening there i'll, I'll reopen it for you so you can see we've got this basic opening type function. There's loads of designs like this on the workshop for Irish doors. They're very simple to actually build. So you can see the rotation that we've got there. And then the second stage is, of course, we need to raise up the actual particle cannon there in the center. Now, in the game itself, this is the charging point where you can see all the energy building up at the end of the particle cannon. And then the final stage is, of course, firing the weapon itself. So we fire that up and you can see the laser then goes up into space and is redirected background at a ground target ready to be destroyed so that is the particle cannon let's um shut this guy off so you can see we'll turn the actual laser off we'll lower that back into the housing so once it's had its 30 second burst i'm not sure how long it actually lasts but there we go it then gets closed back up why it takes a number of minutes to recharge and in the game this is definitely a super weapon and in the terms of space engineers you could definitely turn this into an extremely deadly weapon if you could aim that laser up at various crafts out of orbit it'd be a very dangerous position something that other players would want to take out so i'll show you the basics of the interior it's very very simple in here we've just got ourselves some control towers and i've not actually built a ladder in because the, the main thing with these cnc generals builds that i've tried is you don't know how the interior of the building is actually laid out you can see the exterior and you get a nice idea of it but there's a lot really to be missed anyway that was just a quick insight into a bit of a mess around project that i've been having to go with if you guys would like to see me build anything else or i've got any comments or things that, that i've done wrong with this particular build let me know in the comment section below and i will see you next time